seven. Shit, I don't know, man. Three, three months, maybe longer. I'm not even supposed to be driving it, but I don't want to get flat spots on the tires. Come on, baby. There goes my door. Ooh. Just going to go around the block. I don't lose all my lights. They're just sitting in there. They're not bolting in or nothing. Oh shit. Something's, something's dragging. Feels like my, my, uh, maybe my, uh, back brakes maybe sticking. I've got a drag on the right side for some reason. Huh. I'll look at it when I get back. I'm just going around the block. Like I said, I'm trying to keep it from getting flat spots. Hello, Facebook people. I love this car. I don't know why. But I'm determined to finish it somehow. The city's on my ass. They don't want me working on it. That's just the sound of the axle. I don't know. Um, they don't want me working on it. They don't want me painting it in the driveway. And uh, and I don't have a garage. I bought all the paint. I bought all the parts to put it back together. Lights, trim, everything to go back on this car. I've got minimal body work to do on it. I need to get it in primer because it's, it's never had a, it's never had a paint on it. Uh, it's original paint. I've scuffed it down, got all the clear off of it. A couple little uh, hell dings or door dings, about the size of the end of your pinky finger that I patched. Um, you know, it just needs it needs a little more scuffing and primer. Hopefully, uh, epoxy primer to you know seal the whole thing off. <clears throat> which I don't, I don't have that. I just was going to just 2K it and call it good, but I'd really like to seal it if I could. But anyway, I don't have a place to paint the silly thing. So anybody here, y'all, anybody out there hearing me cry like a baby, uh, Philip Eagle has been kind enough to said he could help me out maybe with his garage. I don't know. Um, but uh, I'd like to get it get it done this year hopefully like I said I bought everything the paint and everything it's just a matter of just a matter of doing it um, I don't want to park in mama's spot that car was behind there's a car behind me I don't guess he liked me not having any brake lights I need to pick up my Christmas stuff I won't turn it around so the city won't think it's just sitting there. Everybody, families, you need to sell it, you need to sell it. I don't want to sell it. I like my little piece of shit car. So, anyway, it's a four cylinder conversion. It was real clean when I got it. It cleaned up real well. And I got the wild hair that I wanted to be able to show it. And, uh, Instead of just paint, respraying the bumpers, because I didn't figure I could make it match, I decided to just go ahead and scuff it and respray it. And that's where I'm at on it. Car runs good when it's warmed up. Like I said, I haven't, I haven't touched this thing in, I don't know, three or four months, maybe three, four. And I'm over too far, because I'm holding the pole. I need to. I'd like to get it painted, get me a TKO 500 in it, because this T5 is a piece of shit, it jumps out of gear, and uh, I'd like to get a new clutch, TKO 500 in it, and then uh, supercharge it, uh, flywheel, uh, excuse me, harmonic bouncer, supercharge it, the Doug's going to help me with, if I ever get the money for it. And then uh, I'd like to uh, start it one more time. 
my flywheel's grinding a little bit. I checked it not too long ago and it's all nice and tight under there, but it's brand new starter. And I've had about four or five starters on it. Uh, but uh, I need to drive it. It's got a little flutter. Of course it's not warmed up. Anyway, that's my video for probably another three or four months or pictures. I didn't want to really post anything until I got it done, but <clears throat> what did Ford design this thing? Anyway, uh, you like my little door latch there, a little bungee cord? I'm going to get this hat. I've got some sports cars that go too well. Okay. Uh... Like I said, I've done most of the body work. It had a few just minor, minor things on it. That's all the little splotches there. Um, nothing major, nothing very, not deep at all. And uh, keep my door shut. I'm starting to get a little, little surface rust around. That's actually plastic dip. I need to get that off there and redo the whole thing. That was the only place I went down to bare metal. That's why the trunk looks so ugly. I went down to bare metal, realized the car had only had one, some surface rust. One, it's never been painted. So with that being said, I decided to stop right there on the trunk and uh, shit, and I start scuffing it. Believe it or not, fellas, even though this is a four cylinder conversion, uh, no, my handy body work. I still got to line this up a little better right in here. I had, when I lost the fender, this got dented real bad because it, it caved in. I lost one of the wheels and this caved in right in here where my hand is. And, uh, I've still got a little bit of gap right there I need to fix. But I've scuffed the hood and, you know, I've got, like I said, I got all lights for it and everything. And, uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, uh, I'll, I'll be honest. I've got a lot of money tied up in this little fucker. Uh, I paid too much for it to start with. I gave six for it. And uh, with that being said, I've got $2,500 in wheels and tires. So I'll call that seven, right? No, we'll call that, 50, let's say 1500 We'll call it 75 another five in the hood. That's eight. Uh, I've got a thousand in just paint products, you know, the paint and the clear. So we'll call that nine, nine thousand dollars. So you figure time I, I'm missing something that I forgot, you know, fender. <laughs> uh, I had to put uh, a couple starters on it, you know, alternators. And uh, I've got over 10 in it just sitting in its ugly ass self right there. I've got over I've got over 10 grand in it. So I can't afford to sell it. There's my fat helper. Hey ninja. You gonna say hi to people? Okay. Um, I've got 10 in it, so you know I couldn't I couldn't afford to take five for it. Couldn't afford to take six for it. So I hate to let it go at six and nobody's going to give me that for it. So, I mean, I'm, I'm going to hang on to it. I love it. And I, my plan on, I know I'm just rattling. My plan is to keep it. And I got a daughter that's three. And one day when her daddy's not here, maybe, maybe she'll end up with it. Because she loves her daddy's Mustang. I just wanted to rattle. I don't get on Facebook and rattle a whole lot, but... I'm in the rattling mood. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.